What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome back to another episode of our Pokemon Brilliant Diamond walkthrough. Okay, so it has been a while. <laughs> a little bit of a while, like this much. Yeah, my bad guys. Uh, a lot has happened within the last few days, and this may maybe even a month since I played this game. And uh, I do apologize. Yes, we're getting back into schedule and all that crud. And, uh, well, enough talking. Let's get it. Anywho, here we are in Heart Home, I believe. Is this Heart Home? Let me see. Uh, the town map. You gotta love it. Yes, we are in Heart Home Town, and we have to go to the contest hall. Now, hmm. Did we battle? I think we did. I think we did battle or something. I don't even know, guys. So, we're gonna be healing up our Pokemon, and uh, from there, we're just gonna be uh, taking a tour of Heart Home, maybe even battling with somebody. Anybody. I don't know. And, uh, well, there we are. We are fully rested and ready to go. And uh, what is going to happen is we're going to be taking a small tour. Now, as you guys can see, let's go right next door. Next door, you will be able to find somebody very, very important. You go up to her, and she's going to talk to you. Hiya! Oh, I've seen you somewhere before. Where was it again? Hold on. It'll come to me. Oh, yeah! You're the one who was battling those scary-looking guys in Jubilife City. I was really curious about you after that, so I went ahead and did a little research. And then, surprise, surprise, turns out you're connected to the, uh, the world-famous Professor Rowan. And you've been going around defeating gym leaders, too. I seriously thought my eyes were, uh, were going to pop out of my head. Oh, sorry. There I, uh, there I go running my mouth again. It's me, Beeb, or Beb, or Beebe. I don't even know how to say it. You remember me, don't you? No, not really. I'm the one who gave you the ball capsules, and hey, you know those Pokemon boxes that you've been using. I'm the system administrator of them. Ah, so, she's the one that does it all. Anywho, after talking to her, yes, uh, your Pokédex, or your Poke, uh, what was it called, uh, your box is no longer under the assumption of anybody hidden or anything like that. So, let's go right here, and as you guys can see, well, hello, hello there. Hello, Mr. Mr. Quadruple Buns. And as you guys can see, oh, I am so sorry. Please excuse me. Are you entering the Super Contest show? Oh, enjoy yourself, please. Incidentally, Fantina, the Heart Home Gym leader, also happens to be a Super Contest show expert. And you may ask yourself, how do I know this? Well, I'm Fantina. You may challenge me, but not yet. You must become stronger. Then you may challenge me. Okay, I, I, I'll see you. Bye, bye. And, uh, well, once you go into the contest hall, you're gonna be finding out a few things, like... Like this. Oh, my hero! Oh, hi, Draven! Wait, no, really, Joanna is... Joanna's your mom? So you might be the Super Contest Show star! Oh, I didn't know about that. I've never spoken to Draven about Super Contest Shows. I'm surprised you two know each other, though. Oh, yes, that's right. I need to thank you for earlier. Please take this sticker. And we have, uh, Etherol. Etherol. Wait, 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 what's an Etherol? I don't even know. So we got ourselves an Etherol sticker and uh, place that sticker on one of your ball capsules and before the show, it will lend a nice touch to sophistication and glamour. I am a show judge, so come, uh, come join us for uh, all kinds of fun if you're unsure of yourself. Uh, we also offer practice sessions. Okay, Joanna, I'll see you. Well, this is the first time that we, we get to hear, like, our mom's name. She's mom, not Joanna. Mom. Anywho, were you surprised to see me, Draven? I got so bored, uh, so I came out to Heart Home for a little vacation. I'm just as surprised as, uh, to see you here, my dear. But are you serious about entering Super Contest shows? Not dressed that way. It's your Pokemon's time to shine, so you shouldn't just be dressed your usual way. Put this on for a little glamour, and we get ourselves a tuxedo. Which, uh, I don't think we're going to be using because, well, yeah, we're not really into the contest shows or anything like that. Anywho, I'm sure it will, uh, look good on you. After all, I chose it. Go enjoy the Super Contest show, honey. Shows uh, will give you a different look at many charms of Pokemon. It should be an eye-opening experience for you. Bye now. Okay, Mom. See ya. Now, there is just one more thing if you talk right here. You're going to the end, uh, you're going to enter the Super Contest show, but I don't see a Poffin case. It could be enough for you to win the kinds of shows without one, but if you're determined to enter, don't let me stop you. It wouldn't hurt you hurt to get in some practice at the uh, counter on at the right. Hmm. You don't say. 
yeah, we're not going to be doing anything right here. Uh, we're not practicing. We're not even into the contests or anything like that. We're just trying to be the greatest ever that ever existed. So let's go ahead and take a small tour of this whole area. As you guys can see, we're going into this uh, area or this, this house, and we're going to be talking to everybody. Babies and Pokemon get along perfectly together. When babies take naps, Pokemon go to sleep right next to them. Ah, you don't say. Well, now, you're a Pokemon trainer. That makes bo uh, that makes you both Papa and Mama your Pokemon. Uh, you know how... You know how having Pokemon around leads to new discoveries. This is the same for parents and kids. I'm always learning from my kids. That is true. And when I get bigger, I'm going to be a Pokemon trainer too. That is cool. Awesome. Great. Oh, wow, you're a Pokemon trainer. Having lots of Pokemon around is a lot of responsibility, but that also comes with a lot of fun. That is true. I don't know how many Pokemon I've captured so far. Um, there should be somebody here with it. It's gonna give us something free. And my sisters get all the attention. No one even notices me. That sounds like a personal problem right there. And here, let's go into the next uh, the next floor right here. And I'm about to sneeze. Oh my god, I'm about to sneeze! <laughs> Excuse me. Anywho, man, I am like always sickly and all that stuff. That is no good. Talk to this guy. All my grandchildren are clamoring for Pokemon of their own. It may be, it may be tricky to manage it, but it will brighten up the mood here. Our home is a kid-friendly city, they say, but I disagree. Our home city is friendly to kids, grown-ups, and Pokemon, too. Okay. And this guy. A world in which people are compassionate to others. That's all that matters to me. Yeah, we're not going to get any free items right here, guys. I'm, I'm sorry. Unless she gives us something. Oh! Oh, no. There are no stairs in this house. It's easier that way. The lack of stairs makes it, e or makes it easy for a little uh, Pokemon to get about. Okay, so we are literally getting nothing. Zilch. Z uh, yeah, you, you guys you guys get my, my drift right here. So, we're going to be going down, and we're going to go downstairs. Now, ah, there we go. You got to love the uh, cough medicine and all that stuff, because, you know, your boy has been sick for quite some bit, some time, and there we go. Cough medicine will work, and that way it will enable me to talk to you guys and all that stuff trust me i've been getting the comments of you guys not liking the whole uh, what was it called the whole coughing and everything like that which brings me to the, the point should i capture a coughing because of this probably not okay so let's see i was given atm for strength at the lost tower the lost tower is on route 209 on the way to salacian sound ah salacian sound now, let's see, talk to this guy, he's gonna be like, I, am, I lived in a total seclusion in, up in the mountains for 30 years. I'm going to clean up at the super contest shows with a dance move that I came up with. Again, I am not going to play that game, um, it really isn't for me. Now, when you talk to this person, when I take my baby out on a stroller, I see the, diff the town in a different way. I notice things like chair or stair stairs and bumps in the sidewalk. Ah. Okay, so let's go right in here and see what this is all about. And that was just a small pause. Wow, that kind of scared me a little bit right there. Okay, so let's see. Talk to this person. People all over the world follow super contest shows. What should I do? I could captivate the whole world. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. I've never been in there. There are the super contest shows. Then we have the Amity Square. We have visitors from all over, so we need to keep the city looking nice which we will pay a visit to Amity Square in just a little bit. And, uh, well, let's go right ahead. I'm getting messages all over the place. Let me see. Yeah, you gotta love it. Yes, okay. Alrighty. So, let's go right ahead and continue on our adventure right here by talking to these people. I have something for your Pokemon to hold. Take this shell bell. And there we go, guys. We got ourselves a Shell Bell, which will, uh, let's see, I think that will heal up our Pokemon every turn, right? Probably, yes. Okay, so let's see. Let's get the heck out of here. Let's go downstairs and let's see what the, let's see what this whole thing brings about to us, you know, that kind of stuff. Anywho, I am uh, having fun with this, I guess. Let's see. 
again, getting messages like nobody's business. Okay, so, uh, if we talk to this guy, this guy, the, the, he's the one that took us to the Pokemon Center. So he's telling us I'm visiting here all the way from the Hoenn region. I've been hoping to find the contest hall, but being new, I lost my way. Fortunately, the local people were very kind to lead me to my destination. I was impressed by their kindness and I generously to, or, and generosity to a complete stranger. Now, may I offer you a courtesy of showing you the contest hall? Yeah, I'm not going to do that. And I'm not telling you to mind your own business. I'm just saying you already took me there. So we're going to go in here. And what we're going to find is, uh, I guess, the the Pokemon fan club. So let's go right ahead and talk to the president, which I am assuming. Okay, if I can just, like, control this whole thing right here. And hello, hello. How I, how I say do you do? I am the Pokemon Fan Club Chairman. Indeed, yes, I am. When you wish to treat your Pokemon to a treat, what I say do you do you do do? If I may say so, and I will feed Poffins to my Pokemon, and it, it, why and why I say why would okay? This guy's talking in riddles and all that stuff. Because of because the giving of Poffins is a way of expressing your love. For example, if I were to give you a sweet Poffin, the Pokemon eating it would become more cute. For example, a spicy Poffin will add to the coolness of the Pokemon. In such ways, I say the Poffins have nothing but goodness for Pokemon. Therefore, I declare this Poffin case to be a gift from me to you. You know, a, a, a rare candy, an Eevee, pretty cool Pokemon. That would suffice. I guess not. Okay, so I urge you to fill it with Poffins and to be generous in dispensing them for to your Pokemon. You don't think? All right, let's uh, let's go ahead and talk to that lady out the corner right there, and she's gonna be like, "Welcome to the Pokemon Fan Club." Oh, you're Monfernomon. It's quite friendly to you. It must be happy being with you. Yes, it is. It's very happy because it has a nickname, Monfernomon, just like the Digimons and all that stuff. Anywho, I do believe that is. No, we still got some more. What do, okay, I want to know what this 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 part is. This right here, okay? Uh, Poffin House. Okay, so if you guys go right here, this is where, you, where you're going to be finding the place to you know mix your poffins and do your poffins and all that stuff. I was kind of thinking that you can actually capture yourself a uh, an Eevee. So if you go in here, it's a church. I've done this before in Pokemon Platinum twice. Uh, the last. Uh, and stuff and oh wow I'm a big stepper anywho religion you gotta love it let's get the heck out of here before we ruin something <laughs> anywho let's get the heck out of here and uh, I think the last thing that we need to do is go into the Amity Square so I might as well let this guy just take me or actually hold on before that oh come on Mm, I hate this guy. Ta-da! Kept me waiting again, Draven. Let's see how much stuff you and I have gotten right here and right now. Hey, you're a trainer now. You're expected to be ready for battle. No whining, no waiting. Let's get this show started. Yeah, we're, gonna, we're probably going to put this on like a clip. Okay, so here we go, guys. We're taking on Barry. The kid with the Jim Carrey haircut from Ace Ventura, Pet Detective, and all we're all we're trying to do is just trying to mind our own business. He won't let us do that, so he must pay. Alrighty, here we go. Flame wheel, finish it. That's right. We show no mercy in this guy dang dojo. Yes, and my Pokemon are growing levels like crazy. All right, here comes a, a Primplup. Oh wow, okay. He he he's becoming a big dog. Okay, so let's go ahead and switch out our Monfernomon and go straight for Electro Star. All right, Electro Star, you're looking pretty cool, pretty awesome, pretty fantastic. And here we have Primplup. Yes, take that Intimidate. You won't hurt us. Okay, what do you have to say? Oh yeah, I'll show you something wicked too. Uh, well, you won't show me anything because here we go with a Spark Attack. Take this, you penguin. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's right. That's how you do it, guys. And look at this. Smoke. Rosa level 26. Starblade level 26. And, uh, well, he's going to be coming out with his Roselia, so we probably, we probably should use Monferno Mon just to beat this guy. Oh, yes. All right. And, well, let's go right ahead 
and take care of business. Let's go with a flame wheel attack at the risk of, you know, getting poisoned, paralyzed, or put to sleep or something. There we go. Eat it, Roselia. Peace. Now, in some countries, I think that's like flipping you off. I do apologize if that's the case. <laughs> and, well, look at that. My Pokemon are growing levels. This is awesome. And he's coming out with a Ponyta. All right. Time to use the man, the myth, the legend. Hail Hydra. And here we go, Hail Hydra. And, uh, well, here comes Ponyta. Ponyta's looking all majestic AF. But unfortunately, we have Intimidate. Alrighty. Time to do it. Let's go with a waterfall. We are talking like if, uh, you know, we're in a Japanese Kung Fu movie and all that stuff. I'm a pretty big fan of those guys, believe it or not. And look at them. In Hydra, he grows to level 24 and is learning Crunch. Let's go right ahead and take away Bite. And, uh, yes. Taking away the weaker move for the strong move. And there you go. Holy buckets. Yeah. Let's get it. And Trainer Barry has been defeated. What just happened? You're, you're just telling me I lost? You owe me a million bucks, bro. <sighs> you KO'd my team again. This messes up my dream of becoming the, uh, the greatest trainer ever. No. I just need to get tougher and keep winning one day. That's it. I'm going to challenge the Veilstone Gym next. See you around, Draven. You'll be blown away by how much stronger I'll be next time we meet. Yeah, I don't believe that. Anywho, I gotta take a small breather, guys. Uh, I got 20 minute time limit, so I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, so we're back, and well, <sighs> let's do the final thing. Let's go to Amity Square, and uh, well, like I was gonna do beforehand, I wanna check on a few things, and no, I am not looking at anything. Okay, so let's go ahead and let this guy lead us to the water and all that stuff. I'm pressing, yes, yes. Go ahead, take me to the Amity Square, or not really, but the contest hall. Now, some of you guys have been asking, how am I controlling that with this? This is a USB for, uh, you know, for, this is an 8-bit, uh, an 8-bit do, uh, SN30 Pro controller. You can find these at Best Buy, guys, and uh, they're specifically for the t Nintendo Switch, which, uh, you know, it, I actually bought this on my birthday, and, it, wow, it came in clutch and everything, so I'm actually, I'm actually glad, I, this is an investment, believe it or not. So, we're not going there. We're gonna be going right over here, right to the back side of this whole area, if I can just get away from that pole. I'm not trying to be a stripper or anything, guys. Anywho! Alrighty. Let's see, if you talk to this guy... Um, I'm appalled! They refuse extra in or the entry to my Pokémon. Oh, my poor Gyarados and Steelix. Hmm. You can take a cute Pokémon out for a stroll in Amity Square. Okay, so what constitutes cute? And, uh, well, let's see. If you talk to this attendant, she's gonna be like, you can take a cute Pokemon out for a stroll in Amity Square. Which Pokemon would you like to take a stroll together with? And unfortunately, <laughs> every single one of my other Pokemon are butt ugly. So we're gonna have to go with Monfernomon. Yep, okay, let's go Monfernomon. Run like the wind. Oh man, okay, that's a Clefairy. And talk to this lady. You should talk to your Pokemon. It could occasionally find things, which is true. So, hey, uh, you got something? Did you pick up something, bro? And no, he's just singing. Okay. Um, how about this guy? Uh, those ruins are from a long, long time ago. Now, I did see an item close into that area. We grabbed this. We found ourselves a spooky plate, which, uh, you know, it... You can put that on in Arceus once, you know, we ever find it or something. And seriously, Monfernomon, you're in my way. If you go right here, you're going to find yourself an amulet coin, which can be beneficial for, you know, battling and all that stuff. And, um, I, I guess you don't transport on any of these things. So, how about here? Okay, I'm, like, clicking on him, and he's doing nothing. Okay, stop. Okay, okay, how about here? Nothing. So, you would think that you would actually transport somewhere. Or am I missing something? Probably. I don't know. It's been a while since I played this game. And, well, let's go right down here. Let's see. If you go right here, we're going to find ourselves a TM45 Attract, which could be beneficial if you're trying to take on, like, a female or male. 
And this lady right here is like, hello! Here you may cook berries and turn them into poffins. And right now I'm not trying to do any of that stuff. Poffins are for the uh, the contest, which again, like I said, I'm not going to be doing any of that stuff. And, well, here we found ourselves a TM43 Volt Switch. A very powerful move with an extra effect on there. And, well, we're just going to keep on going up and down to see if we can find something. And I'm here to let my, or I'm here with my happy knee every single day. I can let it run free without any worries at all. Ah. And it would seem that they shortened up everything right here. And Monfernamont has not found anything. Okay. Let's get the heck out of here. Are you feeling refreshed? Please come again. Yes. I still can't. Wait, hold on. What? Oh, it looks like your Pokemon was uh, taking a stroll with you and wants to go out. Only special trainers can make their Pokemon feel that way. I'm pretty sure that your Pokemon would be delighted if you let it out of their Pokeballs outside of the square, too. I think you can do that. Hmm. I wonder. Oh, you can! Huh! Look at that. So I guess you get the you gain the ability to move your Pokemon out of the Pokeballs, and I think Yeah, okay, so yeah, you you can bring them out of the Pokeballs and makes them a lot happier. This actually increases happiness too, guys. Anywho, in the next episode we're gonna be traveling somewhere. Anywhere. I don't think we can go to the gym. So I will see you guys in the next episode as we travel somewhere in Sinnoh. And again, uh, sorry about the lateness of this whole thing. So, see you guys next time. <laughs> I'll see you guys next time.